Alright, hello everybody, and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3, where I think we killed everyone inside this place. Um, everyone's dead. Yeah, I mean, except the rats. We left the rats alone, but um, everyone's dead in here, so no one's left alive, and nothing's <laughs> we've stolen everything. <laughs> Anything that's kind of just, you know, has value, we just shoot at it too, because uh, screw your stuff. That's a what I kind of been doing is just being a menace to this place because I can be. But anyways, let's continue on. You, not supposed to be here. You're not supposed to be here either. Well, well, well. Yeah, yeah. Well, well, well. It might be time for you to leave. George, how about you? Um, a uh, sixty-five percent chance. Oh, George. Yeah. Nice job, George the o Ogre Slayer. <laughs> You have anything interesting? No, you have That's nothing right. on you. Make sure to kick the body along the way. Yeah! Right in the nashes! Ugh. <laughs> uh, there better be a soft bedroll in my near future. Ugh. You better stop being a whiny little bastard. Get back the looting. Ooh. Okay, so apparently this is Find a Night song. Uh, they were looking for it, I guess we're gonna try to find it. Or something like that, good god. It's a cave, it's a ladder. It's a place to throw bodies down if you don't need them anymore. Oh wow, look at this place, this is great. We get a free torch. Yeah, it's a, we went all the way down and they built something crazy down, oh. Oh, this is fantastic, mushrooms. What the hell? Oh, what the? Hey, that's a. That's a minotaur. Well, that was a minotaur, and he just got he got his cheeks clapped for that. All right. Well, this seems easy enough. We could just pull this lever, I guess, and get out here and see what this uh, minotaur has. Nothing. What a joke. Oh! Whoa! 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 Oh! Oh shit! What's going on? I suppose you want to hear about cat. <laughs> Sure, um, who's Cazador and <laughs> all this stuff? <laughs> Alright, I wonder if we try this again, what will happen? So we're gonna go out here. We're gonna talk to you. I suppose you want to hear about Cazador. Cazador Zar is a vampire lord in Bald Death. The Patriot. Well, that was fun. <laughs> I do like how the conversation just stops. <laughs> Everyone's just like, well. <laughs> well, looking at this front door, while wow, it would be tempting to um, loot everything that is um, out here, you guys can keep it. You know why? Uh, screw you guys. Fireballs to the face. Whatever it is. Um, yeah, screw that. Um, I want no part of that. And I guess we'll just... Uh, Go along this outside. What's down here? Look at this. You're a petrified person. Why am I scared? Oh, okay. W what's going on? We're all surprised. Must have seen some. Bard alone. <laughs> what is that delay? <laughs> Oof. <laughs> he really does not like my bard. What's up with all you guys now that you're, um, fine? You should be more concerned with who I am. I am Dawn, third son of House Bartol, first rank evoker, and initiate of Graven Hollows. Oh. Oh no, no, my dear dark gods below, no! I admit, I like this one's approach. A little genocidal. But effective. Come. 
looks abandoned. Yeah, sure, it always looks abandoned. Going through the underdark, everything's abandoned. What's this? Got ourselves an infiltrator. Praise the absolute. Anyway. The hunt's not over yet. Tracking a runaway slave, deep gnome. Stole boots from my sergeant, but she's holed up with Mike and it. Skip a leather. I ain't wasting more words on you until it's done. They're coming. They're coming. Zorvari! What in the hells are you? She has come. What in the nine hells is that? She is here. You see a vision. Your lifeless body wrapped in fungal tendrils. The Sovereign is threatening you. State your purpose. Threatening me? What do you think I am? Huh. Well, there seems to be a little mushroom town here. Or... Alright, get on up here. Let's see what you all gotta say. Sovereign's thick fingers stroke the corpse at its feet. Droning melody greets you. As the creature turns its gaze to you. Oh man, somebody been dropping some blotters. Talker, I sense your resolve. You will find Dwerga invaders near Lake's Edge. Cleanse the rot. Destroy them. What's up with you? Why are you Don't so cranky? Don't. Shadow Dark Ale for everyone. Go on, drink up! Ah, God! Whatever that is, I needed it. I drink to that. But here, I nabbed these boots from the Greys when I ran. I'll feel better knowing you're using them to kick some Dwegger ass. Do it. Ignis. Nothing unusual. Do you guys care that I just wiped everybody out? You're a welcome sight. This adventurer has an illithid tadpole inside her head, but she hasn't turned. No cerimorphosis. That's impossible, but intriguing. Geich, your head will make a fine trophy for my queen. I ask that you refrain from violence. Geich. Please hold. Geich. This is pointless. Open your mind to me. Let us see what lurks within. <laughs> no, we, what? This is most unusual, but I have an idea. Geek. I possess a ring of mind shielding. It prevents elder brains from noticing my presence. I would offer it as a gift, but in truth, the ring is priceless. Is there anything you could offer me in turn? <laughs> There's a lot I could offer you in return. I mean, do you like explosion barrels? Who would like that ring now, please? I like how we blew everything up except the items around here. So, you're just standing there like whatever. Uh, anyways, I think that's good enough for now. Um, we did a lot of damage here. Uh... Things happened, <laughs> people blew up. Oh, he doesn't stand anymore. Oh well. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed that part and we'll continue on through the Underdark all the way through. There should be a lot more things going on. So until then, hope to see you all around next time. Have a good one and goodbye. I like how all the mushrooms just don't care what happened. Yeah, you wouldn't pay me enough to go down a ladder like that. Screw that.
Yeah, since you boys are going to be jerks to me, how about you, um, how about you take a spectre? There you go, you can fight one yourselves. I'm going to get out of here. I offer to parlay, and he brings a spectator. Quit. I wonder if we throw this. <laughs> Spectre versus Spectre. I don't know what's... They're confused. I'm confused. What? Oh, this does not seem like a good idea. Hey, look at that. We all s failed survival. Rock under your feet juts upwards forming a perfectly engraved tombstone with a small epitaph. In memory of Myrna, a shining light in this dark world, may you forever gaze upon the lake you love to play in. Well, you know what they say. Whatever's left there is mine. If you got a shovel, dig for it. As you dig, you slowly expose the skeletal remains of a large dog wearing a chunky leather collar. Strange collar. It's got runes all over it. This must have belonged to Lenore's dog. Definitely magical, too. Yeah, so I have this collar, and you know what? If I put it on temporarily, press this button that's up here in the Arcane Towers. Clever. Food is dispensed for anyone wearing this collar. Look at that. A free raw steak. Yeah, look at that. Free <laughs> camp supply. Hysterian, hey, how about you try this out? No more. Not one for gluttony, I see. <laughs> well, I guess you only get one. Alright. Well, you done mucking about yet? 